background. Oh yeah, I'm loving the Undertale music right now. Oh, down smash right. out of shield. One seven thirty-eight bit. Nijo Fuego. <laughs> One seven thirty-eight. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, so god. far. Be weaving in and out, just throwing out projectiles, having a pretty easy time so far. DD has a hard time getting in, but once he does get it, he has a lot more options available. Get the damage. Oh, but speaking of damage, Ryu coming in with the up tilts. No follow up though. On top of these platforms, it's going to be a lot easier for that true shore you can kill. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's fishing for it right now. Well, that, that was an opportunity. Yeah, he, he went for it right there, but he messed up the input. Yep. So much percent being tacked on, showing really DDD's issue with this matchup. Unsafe shield uh, fair right there mm -hmm. to get him in a lot of trouble. Ooh, went for an up smash right there. All right. Chuck oh, he went for it. He wanted oh. him to roll so bad. Hit that, uh, his V special, that <laughs> parry. <laughs> the V special. We bring in the Street Fighter Five in here. I, I respect it. From now on, it is the V special. Oh, missing these shore you can just by a bit. Clean back air though. Punch is gonna be coming back pretty easily here. DDD pretty much comes back from anywhere on the stage. Ooh, Ryu's at the glory percent. Not anymore though. Jump oh, he went in deep. And you have to. What oh, a great follow up right there. Man. Miho thinking about it for a second. Knowing that oh, yeah, the smart. Yeah, smart. Yeah, get him out on the ledge there. Yeah, he tried to cheese him right there, going on the ledge. If it works. Use it. Mm -hmm. Is the rule. Yo, Tortilla the pun. Good first impression so far. At least to me. Yeah, so far he's been doing really good. He's not. There it Ooh, is. There it is. Baited the sidestep. Got that true sure you can. Either way, that man was in a lot of trouble. Yep. Now, uh, Miho had some very, very strong uh, leads and also had some solid opportunities for kills in that first stock. Dropped a lot of it. If he keeps it up here, he should have an easy time, but the pun. One has quite a bit of solid DDD tech he's throwing around right now. Solid understanding of this character. Tortilla the pun. Is that supposed to be like a pun version of Attila the Hun? Because I think that's what he's going for. Yeah, yeah quite possibly. All right. All right. I, I see you, Tortilla. Okay, nice up there right there. Wow, that, that platform messed him up. I think he would have actually caught him. Sure, you can. Sure you, but it's still not enough. Oh, oh, it's wow. all about the fishing. Miho going in. <laughs> there it is. Mm, stale though. Yeah, I think he, he got it. Yeah, too. He, yeah, he got him on the like the, the upper part of it. Right. Miho knows exactly what he needs, but the pun getting some solid damage off that grab right there. Trying oh, to lay down for some a traps. setup. Yeah. All right, pun. You're gonna play lamb a little bit. Good damage. With all this rage tapped. Oh, on. he's covering it. There are okay, a yeah, lot good. of possibilities. Good action on uh, Miho. And true sure you can. That was a back air coming out of Tortilla. The <laughs> Tort <laughs> Tortilla the now, now I'm thinking of Attila in my head. When there I you go. You, you're about to say Attila yeah. the Hunt, right? From Tortilla the Pun. I'm just going to call him the Pun. The Pun. Yep. The Pun is coming out with the back air, but invincible upbeat. Sure you can. True input gets you that invincibility. Yeah, good stuff coming from Miho. Uh, the pun was about to bring it back, though. Yeah, he did a very, very solid job there. Very solid. I mean, one of the cool parts about playing an, an, an underplayed character is that you get the meta to develop on your side. You have to play against all the popular characters. Well, no one plays against your character. No one plays against you would think Ryu would be a more popular character. Oh, are we talking no, about talking about DD. Okay, I was going to say, because, like, I mean, it could apply for Ryu, too. Like, not many people here actually do play Ryu. That's true. Well, maybe because he's more of a difficult character to play. But ever since we lost our one and only Pump Magic. The DDD circle has been looking a little uh, empty. Yeah. But Pun so far has been showing a good job uh, maintaining uh, stage control and actually getting in damage where it's due. Yeah. I like, like right that Miho is crossing up on shield, keeping him out of a grab situation. Because he has seen what the pun can do with one solid grab. Yeah. Ooh, oh, right out that Gordo, too. That yeah, was clean. He was trapped in that situation. Didn't have too many options other than to roll up. But he was 
still could be very afraid of announcement. And he focus attacked that Gordo too. That was pretty good too. He's throwing them bows. Get on the bows. Ooh, we're trying to break his shield right there. Pun's got, some, Pun's got some good setups with that. Now, uh, Miho's being really smart about the Gordo, knowing that the Pun is trying to trap Miho in the situation. So he either completely avoids it, or he'll hit it right back at the ball. Yeah. Are we going to see it there? You totally dare to. Yeah, he could have. Well, he charged up smash, but a pun caught him slipping. Definitely just don't want to be charging smash seven nowhere. Miho actually taking it a little bit too slow now. You know, giving Ooh, that was Ooh. Uh, that was really crisp right there. I like that. It's actually very uh, disrespectful to double dip at the point. Yeah. But, yo, the pun, that was that was a clean combo, but then Miho just responded. He's like, nah, you're not gonna do that to me. You're yeah. just gonna eat this DP real quick. Now, something I've noticed is a really big difference between uh, Miho and Pair of Ducks is that Pair of Ducks will go in with that down air because it'll pop them up. And yeah. usually people are going to go for the air dodge because they want to tech it. Mm -hmm. And then Pair of Ducks ends up getting a really strong follow-up afterwards. Uh, Miho likes to go for a lot of forward air dare. Yeah, forward air and dare. Maybe it's just a personal preference kind of thing. Quite possibly. Okay. Tatsumaki? Nope. It popped a little too far up. Yep, one hit too many. Picked up Miho's lost down on a couple of good grab opportunities. The pun still down a stock here and has been taking a percent. But yeah, I think that's just his that's his been his answer every time he's gotten up from the ledge. Just do a true input sure you can so you can yeah. get out of the Gordo and hit DDD at the same time. Okay, that Gordo finally gonna kill though. Yep, there's the kill. Oh there was the, there was a little crouch there. The DDD taunt special. I would go straight down for the down. I wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, I mean, probably you would have, but yeah, me, Miho's like trying not to get he's like. Trying to win, he, so. He's trying to win. He's trying to not die at zero, you know? I really like that he went for a charge off smash. Mostly because he's going to be expecting the shoot short you. Yeah. Go for the mix up. Yep, yep there's another true one, but there's an up tilt to respond. Miho's been DPing every Gordo that has been getting tossed at him. Oh, and double. the pun has been racking up this damage. <gasps> Perfect shield. That was oh. very good. That V special. <laughs> <laughs> the V special, man. It skipped the beat right there. Back oh, air. Nice out of that. That was good. Honestly, I feel like going for the true short you can was the right option there. Oh, yes, D. But oh, no. Very unfortunate. And, uh, the pun that was keeping up. Mm -hmm. DD can soak up a lot of damage. 